um, there it is. I'll, uh, I'll get the, uh, the weapons in the background. I think that's pretty good. Come on in, everybody. Okay. Well, hey, uh, I just want to thank you all for coming out here on a Wednesday evening. Um, and, uh, you know, these are, uh, these are our real patriots here in this room. Uh, and I just want to pay a special thanks uh, first to, uh, uh, to the owner here uh, of Spec Dive Tactical, Jerry Rapp. All right. Yeah. 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 And uh, from Prince William County, um, our, our uh, platinum sponsor this evening, uh, he lives in Prince William County, a, a, a veteran, a great guy, uh, Steve McCarthy. Hey, Steve. All right. Yeah. 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 Some of you I've known a long, long time. He's a great builder. Um, he makes you know, great homes and, and great commercial. And, and uh, he was a big supporter of President Trump, and I know a lot of you are too. Um, and uh, a real American patriot, and that's Mike Garcia. I also wanted to pay special thanks uh, to the great volunteers, a lot of you in this room. Uh, but uh, somebody who's really been uh, doing the yeoman's work around here, uh, Philip Joy, over here. So, and also a great volunteer, and now he's, as of today, yes, part of the campaign, Mr. Scott Knuth. Thank you. So I won't keep you long. I've been giving so many speeches, I make myself bored. Um, but, you know, we're, uh, we're running a, a great campaign, uh, and uh, as of a couple of days, I, I, a couple of days ago, I think you all know, and the check is in the bank too, uh, but as of uh, earlier this week, I'm very, very proud to get the endorsement of VCDL, the biggest gun rights group in the Commonwealth of Virginia. Yeah. There's nothing more important, there's nothing more important for, a, for an elected official, for a candidate, uh, to do uh, than to protect uh, our rights, our constitutional rights, uh, to protect their lives and protect their safety, and uh, that is why, um, you know, as you know, as chairman of the Prince Board of County Supervisors, I did everything I possibly could do, and I was, we were the first, the very first in the Commonwealth of Virginia to eliminate the concealed carry permit fee. Wow. At, at least. We brought it all the way down from $50. We tried to get, thank you, thank you. We tried to get it all the way down to zero, but unfortunately the state still mandates $15 of that. But we brought it all the way down from $50 all the way down to $15. Um, my, feeling though, yeah. my, feeling though, my feeling though is that, look, if you're, if you're a law-abiding citizen, there is no reason. You are entitled to your constitutional rights. You shouldn't have to pay to exercise those rights. You shouldn't even have to get a permit to exercise those rights. Those rights were guaranteed to each and every one of us as citizens. And that is why I support, and I was the first in this campaign to support, constitutional carry in the Commonwealth of Virginia. A lot of other issues in this campaign. We are coming up strong, folks. And if you ever wonder where we're at, just take a look at what my opponent is doing. He's attacking us left, right, and center. Everything he can do, and we call him Establishment Ed, just in case you're wondering who I'm talking about. He's attacking us every time we make, you know, today we, we just uh, released this, uh, tele, this uh, radio ad. It points out that he will not do anything. Ed will not do anything to protect our heritage in the Commonwealth of Virginia. He said to the Washington Post, that if Charlottesville wants to take down a statue of Robert E. Lee, they can do it. Well, who's next? Let me say this. The city of Charlottesville said, members of that city council, that they're not stopping with Robert E. Lee. Next, they're going after none other than Thomas Jefferson, folks. They're going after Thomas Jefferson. If we don't stand up for our rights, if we don't stand up for our heritage, we're going to continue to back up. I think it's very, very important that we stop running away. We stop running away from our heritage, we stop running away for, from our history and who we are, and we embrace it. We must embrace it. So as governor, I will prohibit any locality, whether it's Charlottesville or Petersburg or Richmond or any other locality in the state or, or Arlington, 
or Arlington from removing any state, any Virginia war, whether they fought in the Revolution, whether they fought in the in the Civil War. On either side, we will stop them from tearing down our history in the Commonwealth of Virginia. My battery's getting low on my phone. So I'm gonna wrap this up. But, <laughs> thanks, <laughs> thanks Victor. Uh, but, um, you know, I know there's a lot of issues. Uh, one of the big ones is uh, taxes. And uh, a lot of small business owners in here, yeah. Mike and others. Yeah. And look, you know, Virginia, you would think as a fairly conservative state that we would have lower tax bills, low, a lower income tax. It's not true. We're on par with Maryland. Yeah. We have, we are on par, we have one of the highest tax rates, income tax rates in the mid-Atlantic area. And that's shameful. And because of that, where are the jobs going? They're leaving Virginia, they're leaving Virginia, and they're going to places like North Carolina. North Carolina, which brought its top marginal income tax rate down from 7.75% in 2010, today, as of January 1st, is 5.49%. And guess what? They have a budget surplus and we have a budget deficit and that is why we have to do what, what North Carolina is doing we've got to cut spending and we're going to cut taxes and under my administration within one year we are going to cut the top marginal income tax rate from 5.75 percent to 4.75 percent making us one of the lowest tax states in the East Coast yeah. 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 So Buy a weapon? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, second a minute. If I can take over two seconds. First of all, Jerry. I love this man to death. This is my second uh, uh, trial for you on this. First, we didn't do Rome, but we got a chance to meet each other, which was great. And I love Thanks that. Thanks a lot. Yeah, appreciate it. All right, so um, I'm Jerry Rapp, the owner of Spec Dive Tactical. Uh, first of all, as we say, it's like my good uh, boy over here and teammate is George, and welcome. And we thank you guys and we thank you for helping out. Um, small business, as you can tell, in the Second Amendment, uh, I fight this every day because people hate me because I have a gun shop somehow. I'm a horrible, horrible businessman because of that. So this is one of the reasons why I'm supporting Mr. Stewart over here. Uh, second of all, you guys are why spec time is what we are. Uh, you're all part of my team. We say that we're part of the team. I come from the, uh, I was a Navy UND diver and I worked with the SEAL team. I was not a SEAL, but I worked with them. So it's all about team. That's what this company's been about since day one. But I literally started as a part-time thing in my freaking basement four years ago. And it's grown to, careful what you ask for, it gets out of control. <laughs> but um, you guys are why it's been successful, and I thank you. And you all are welcome any day. We do guns, we do gear, we do training. We have the largest gunsmithing uh, in, in Northern Virginia. We also do training, and we're here. That's what we do here, is training and instruction. Guns are the easy part, but we teach, and you can ask these two right here, I just taught them, just taught her and some other people. We give away information that way, because that's what our company's all about. It's kind of the same thing he's doing. He's ground down to the way it's supposed to be, and that's what I've liked about it since the moment I started reading about it, and that's why I'm supporting I thank you. Thank you so much, Jerry. All right. So, before you stop it, have you stopped it already? Nope. It's still okay. Going. So, for those of you online, join the team. Go to the website, www.coreystewart.com. Go to Facebook, Corey Stewart VA. Join the team. And together, all of us, we're going to take back, back Virginia. Virginia.